Welcome to my channel. In this quick video, I'm going to show how hackers can hack and remotely control your PC using Metasploit and an apparently innocent image file. But first, a quick disclaimer before we begin. This video is strictly for education and awareness only. It's meant to show how dangerous seemingly innocent image files can be so you can be cautious and protect yourself online. Now let get started. In my case, the image backdoor has already been created, so I will run Metasploit to set up the listeners. MSF console is loading, let's wait a few minutes. Now we're here, let's set up the listeners one after the other. Finally, type run and press enter to wait for the target. Now I'll open the image backdoor I created earlier and see what happens. Boom! You can see the terminal establishes a connection immediately after I open the image. This means the PC has been compromised and the attacker can do anything they like. Now let me check the system information. Boom, here it is, you can see the system information right here. Let me type help to see all the post-exploitation commands. Let me run a command to check real-time information. Here it is, these are the commands attackers use to steal your data without you knowing. There you have it, you've seen how an innocent looking image can compromise your PC without your knowledge. This type of attack is called a steganography attack and it's very dangerous because most malware used in these attacks is hidden in seemingly innocuous files. Now let's talk about how you can protect yourself from this type of attack. Don't accept files from strangers. Only download files from reputable sources. Avoid downloading files from unknown websites. Always be cautious when dealing with people online, because that's where most malware comes from. Most importantly, Make sure you have antivirus software installed on your PC, it can help scan for and remove many types of threats and malware. One final disclaimer before we finish. As I said earlier, this video is for awareness purposes only and does not promote illegal activity. It's intended to show how dangerous innocent looking files downloaded from the internet can be so you can stay cautious and protect yourself. Everything shown in this video was performed in a controlled environment, and all devices used belong to me. I have full permission to use them for this demo. Always act responsibly. If you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and turn on notifications for more cybersecurity videos. I'll catch you in the next one. Thanks for watching.